You should be happy that somebody receives something from anybody or from the master. You should just be happy as if you're the one who receives it. That is the attitude. Okay, huh? Remember. Mm, remember. Mm. Remember Buddha's teaching. Uh, I don't know how many religions you have here. Just uh, I'm more familiar with Buddhist teaching. Because the Buddha, he talked a lot. He had the big calendars. <laughs> For 40 some years he preached. He lived until the ripe age of 80 some. So during all those years he talked and the people recorded his teachings. The Buddha said that the one who gives has merit. Okay? If they give with purity and love, of course, yeah? Otherwise, you may also have merit, but little. Or uh, your merit will turn into something not so favorable to you, even though you have it, huh? Okay. So the Buddha say, if you give with purity and love, your merit is immense, right? But the one who doesn't give, but is happy, <laughs> uh, you know, supportive, happy, for the, the one who gives and happy for the one who receives. Also get married. Remember that. Just remember that, okay? I don't ask you to give everything. I don't expect you to give anything. I told you many times, even if you are supportive, heart or spirit, that's also very good. Huh? I don't really ask you to give anything to anyone. I'm just telling you, and then you decide, okay? You have to decide well, decide nobly, huh? okay? Make me proud. Make your parents proud. Make your ancestors looking down proud. Yeah, making your children proud. Make your family proud, okay? Huh? And I thank you for doing that. <laughs>